Zodi Adjustment Instructional Video Pneumatic Height Adjustment Pneumatic Height Adjustment is used to adjust the seat to fit different heights. Pull the lever up and lift the body out of the chair to raise the seat. To lower the seat, remain seated and pull the lever up. Seat Depth Adjustment Seat depth adjustment moves the seat pan to accommodate for different leg lengths. Pull up on the lever and slide the seat front to back. Tilt tension. Tilt tension adjusts the force necessary for a user to recline in the chair. Turn the crank forward to tighten the tension and backward to loosen the tension. Backstop. Backstop allows users the choice of selecting an upright position or limiting the amount of recline. Push down on the lever to activate the backstop. Pull up to release it. Forward tilt. Forward tilt allows users to sit forward in the chair during highly task intensive work. To activate, push down on the forward tilt lever. Recline and then lean forward. Pull up and recline to release it. Arms. Arm height adjustment raises and lowers the arms to keep the user's shoulders in a neutral posture. To change the height of the armrest, pull up on the lever and slide the armrest up or down. Armrest side to side adjustment accommodates users with various shoulder widths. Grasp the armrest cap and move it in or out as needed. Armrest front to back adjustment allows users to get close to the work surface while maintaining effective use of the backrest. Grasp the armrest cap and move it forward or backward as needed. Armrest pivot allows the user to have proper support for the forearm when mousing or keying. To change the angle of the armrest, grasp the armrest cap and rotate the front of the armrest toward your body or away from your body. Lumbar Adjustment Lumbar height adjustment allows the user to position the lumbar pad in the lumbar curve or the small of the user's back. Pull up on the handles to raise the lumbar pad, push down to lower it. Lumbar support helps maintain the lumbar curvature in the spine of the lower back when the user is seated. Rotate the handles up to increase the amount of support and down to decrease the amount of support. Each handle can be rotated independently.